Time lapse from our Windsor Skycam. Andrew, this evening storms swept through at 60 miles an hour. That's right. The packing winds of that strength, and you saw the damage that was done to at least one homeowner's yard, and a lot more of that damage was done throughout much of southeast Michigan. Take a look. Look at the, how it raced and plowed over downtown Detroit, bringing a lot of heavy rain, dangerous lightning, and those damaging winds. The good news is the watches, the warnings that we had earlier, those are all now gone. We have much calmer conditions out there with temperatures that are in the 70s. Here's a look at four live radar. As you can see, the heavier rain that we had earlier, it has now moved on and we're looking at cloudy skies, temperatures currently in the 70s and not much behind what's already gone through. Some clouds overhead, you see a few showers that are moving through parts of uh, Iowa, about to move into uh, Illinois, but it's moving into a little more stable air that's over us right now. So for the rest of the evening, we're left with this. Cloudy, mostly cloudy skies. Temperatures are currently in the 70s, but look at this. Temperature, heat index, all one in the same. That's right, it's a little less muggy out there, a little more comfortable. With temperatures in the low 70s right now, all the way down into the 60s. While it's between 70 and 75 right now, we'll see low and middle 60s by dawn on your uh, Sunday. And showers could continue to diminish. We might see a few on and off light ones, but nothing as heavy, nothing as strong or nasty as what we saw earlier this evening. We'll talk more about Sunday. Does it really spell relief that we're seeing more comfortable conditions now for tomorrow? We'll talk about that and your seven-day forecast in just minutes. All right, thank you.